Today's video from Sharpel, we're going to demonstrate the correct procedure for clearing a paper jam on the XEA 203, 206, 20S or 506 registers. Uh, so on this machine we're using the 203, the process would be the same on, on all the machines. Um, we're trying to process a sales transaction, we're in the reg mode, it's letting us enter the items, so free PLU £1 or department 4, department 4 sorry, but the printer's not moving on and we, I don't know if you can hear it on the video but it's making a, a bit of a strange noise. Um, so if you've got this scenario and uh, the best thing to do is to cancel the transaction you're currently in. So I'm going to subtotal void by pressing subtotal then the void button and then the subtotal key. That way you won't lose any transactions um, or any printouts of transactions. You then lift the printer cover off and deal with the jam. The first thing to do would be to lift this green lever here, lift up the planet arm. We've got a bit of a mess going on here. Um, I'm presuming that you're using the machine in receipt mode, which is how I'm using it. If you're lucky, you won't need to use a new till roll. So I've been able to clear what was causing the jam. So it's basically just some scrumpled up paper. There was nothing, no foreign object in there as such. So you should just be able to reload the paper so the the 203 and all the similar machines are, have thermal printers in them, so they use um, thermal till roll paper which you load like this. So it's the shiny thermal heat sensitive side facing down. You just drop it into place, there's no fancy feed in. Um, then you close the platen arm here. It should click into place and then the paper should feed forward a little bit like that's done. Um, and then if you're using it in receipt mode, paper back through the receipt slot here. Tear off the leftover and then you should be able to re-enter the sale that you had to cancel. If that doesn't work you may need to load a new till roll. The process for that would be exactly the same. It's lift up the platen arm, remove whatever's left over of the old till roll that had got jammed up and take your new 58mm um, thermal till roll paper. Load so the shiny side is facing down. Again, close the flat arm over correctly. The paper feeds on so you know you've done it correctly. Paper back through the receipt slot. And then the till will now be ready to use as before. Okay, I hope that video has been helpful. I've got plenty of other videos showing you how to get the best out of the XEA203 and other sharp cash registers, so feel free to check those out. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit sharphelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.